So my dad got me this circle cutting jig for Christmas because he watched a video of mine making some clocks and he had some concerns about the way I was cutting my circles and the instruments that I was using. So this is a Jasper Tools brand Circle Pro. Bunch of numbers and letters there. I don't know what they mean, but it says cut a perfect circle every time. And this is this is a big cool thing. It uh, you cut these different inches of circles, and if you want a fraction of an inch, you do the different holes, and it tells you it tells you over here which fraction of the inch. I found that out the hard way. I thought all these holes were the same, and then I cut a quarter inch off of my circle, but that's okay. This is what I used before. I just made this up and uh, I designed it for my for my portable router to go straight in that little box there and then cut the circle. But this is not adjustable, obviously, because uh, it only cuts one size. I will say right up front, it has all these holes to be like a universal thing. Universal meaning that it's going to attach to any router that you have just about. I got two routers and only attached to one of them. It did not attach to this router. I couldn't find any holes that matched up to any of the holes on here. So that was a bummer. I had to use this router, which I don't really like, but it's the first router I got and it was the cheapest one and it's plugged and everything, which makes it complicated, but it did screw in to the router jig. So I used it. What I call it a router jig. I mean, circle jig, but you can call it right. Whatever. My dad also pointed out that uh, this router bit that I was using is a straight bit and it doesn't work as well so he says because he was noticing a lot of sawdust was caught up in there oh it's not focusing there it is anyway he told me to get one of these spiral upcut bits so I got a quarter inch shank and a quarter inch router router space whatever you want to call it so I'll try this and see if it works any better. By the way, this bit only costs like 12 or $15 on Amazon. I'm sure they get much more expensive if you want them to be. All right, so let's try it out and see what kind of circle it cuts. So overall, the circle jig did an amazing job, did a great circle. I had some problems, you know, it jumped out at one point, it meandered on me, but I lucked out and nothing went terribly wrong. I should be able to correct those problems in the future now that I know that, it, now that, I know that they can happen. The edge of the circle with the spiral upcut bit is far superior to any of the edges that I had with the straight cut bit. I will say that the sawdust still got caught in the groove even though my dad said the spiral upcut bit would fix that problem it didn't so my dad failed on that one but thanks for the christmas gift dad 